In the previous episode, we saw how the system users can easily build up their profiles within Blazorplate's environment. In this episode, I'm going to show you how users can also update their login credentials. So I'm going to go to the account settings page to change my current password from the password tab. Before doing this, I'm going to click on the eye icon to reveal the passwords that I'm going to type. After saving the changes, I'm going to go to the email tab to switch the email link to my account. By default, the username in Blazorplate is the same as the email address. Usually, in some other systems, the user cannot switch the email link to their account, but in the Blazorplate environment, I can easily link my account to another email. The new email will get validated by sending an account confirmation link to the new email address immediately after saving the form. Now I'm going to sign into my account using the new email and the new password. As we can see, I managed to keep my current account even though I changed my username. Thank you for watching.